As Wenki D, his family and his friends grew older they matured in wisdom and could include in their life folders, sadness and grief, worries and strife, job changes and sometimes worries that strangled, appearing to suck out one's life. Wenki Deek found he had a green thumb, and an answer to the dramas of life, a wonderful fruitful gardener he had become. His answer to life's worries, Wenki Deek planted colorful flower gardens attesting to the beauty of God's glory. Pansies, petunias, asters, tulips, and Swiss chard, spinach and collards from this gardening stalwart, soon began to brighten his neighborhood, giving it a wonderful touch of a man who loved others very, very much. The Beautiful Garden of Winky Deek On this beautiful day, a bee gathers honey, while the busy ants play. After planting grass seed, Mr. Deke leaves enough grass seed for the birds to eat. Mr. D plants a tree.
Winky Deke walking to success. In whatever situation he was placed, Winky Deke always succeeded by doing his majestic best. As for the stinky feet of Mr. Winky Deke, he received a very long-awaited treat. An answer was received when he became a man and became able to change the style of his shoes and buy a better shoe brand. Instead of shoes known as Easy Walkers and shoes made of pleather, Mr. Deke switched his footwear to shoes of a better quality shoes actually constructed of leather. And as for his socks, Mr. Dick switched from an economically priced brand of socks, to socks that were considered by many to be top-notch. But this is not how this story ends. Winky Deke met many people, and he made many, many friends. As with others, he sometimes lived a life filled with woe. But with life, Winky Deke did not stop. He would onward go. This strong centipede man was much admired and he was much loved. He refused to cave in and received many blessings from the good Lord above. He lived to fulfill many of his dreams. He was a godly centipede man, who lived a good life not filled with worldly, ungodly schemes.